And I already have a bad feeling about this. And that fucking sound. What the hell is that sound? Daniel. Also, if you notice the guy that or the if you guys notice that the game is brightened, it's because I turned up the gamma a long time ago, so that way you guys wouldn't have much of a hard time seeing. Because nothing worse than having a black. Shut up, dog. Nothing worse than having a blacked out video that you cannot see at all. Well, yeah, there is one other thing: having 15 frames per second. Alright, so let's see. We have horribly textured shit, horrible textured tinderbox, horrible textured shadows. Yay! Horrible textures everywhere. Alright, so there's nothing else in here. So, let's venture onwards and get the shit scared out of me so badly I have a heart attack and die. And then no one was ever heard of me ever again for the rest of my life. And oh god, the frames are back. Oh, boy, I don't like this at all. Oh, look. A cross with a very poorly textured Jesus on it. I'm such a dick. Alright, so... Books. Newspaper clipping, it seems. Hey, look, the outside of the castle. Just say, it is a bit of a nice-looking castle. All right, so how much you guys want to bet this is going to activate something? Bah! Oh. Agrippa. All right. Weird pictures. All right, there's nothing else in here. So, spider web. God, these walls, man. These fucking walls. I just wonder what those damn monsters are gonna look like now with these horrible, horrible textures. But I'll just pick... Oh, what? Oh, fuck me. Sideways. Alright then. So I broke a window. Look, I can escape! But how high are these trees? That's the question. Daniel, stop getting scared shitless. Alright, I'm afraid of going anywhere else. That fucking dog! I am afraid that thing is gonna come to fucking life and kill me. Had enough of you in Penumbra. Alright, good. It's dead. What's this? Milestones of human anatomy, eh? Oh, hey, look. A dog head. I don't know why, but I find this kind of humorous. Throwing dogs at dogs. Ooh, a shovel! This shall be my weapon. I shall bring it with me. I shall clobber anything that comes over in the head with it. Hey, what's this? The canine spine. Alright, Alexander, what the hell were you doing with these damn dogs? This is a weird looking knife. And same picture. I'll just be taking my shovel, thank you. Maybe I can dig myself a hole and go cry in it. Fucking mannequins. Fucking statue in your penis. God, why does he have st statues with. Is that. Why the hell does he have statues with penises? I'm trying to make a YouTube video here, not a porno. Alright, let's see. More random shit I don't care about. Wait, is that Alexander? No. Hey. It... Fuck, he's old. He doesn't sound that old. Huh. Any 
anyway. Is there even anything of interest in here? I'm just gonna barricade this door. Penises will keep me safe. Oh! Fuck me! I was not expecting that. Well, at least you don't have a penis, so you're good in my book. Oh, look. Tinderbox. And this one? Nothing. Alright, so... That was a waste of time. Let's take my shovel away from this penis man. I don't want him giving my shovel AIDS. And then there's something trying to... Kill me! If I can open this door. Oh. I now notice there's a rabbit over there. Bah. No. And a bird. Let's see what you have to offer. Sense it. It's definitely there. All right, then. God damn, Alexander, what the hell were you doing to these poor animals? Like shovels. You can use them as a weapon, and you can also dig yourself a hole to hide in. And that's sealed off, so we have to go climb out that there window. Let's try and break this. Um. Alright. No more shovel for me then. As I just somehow wedged it inside the glass. Oh boy, glitches. Mario time. Oh fuck. Wait, was that a tree? Oh. Oh, it's the darkness. Hmm. Oh boy, the darkness. More chairs, more light, more elevator re renovation plants? Hmm. Oh, right, okay, ajar door. Ajar doors are not fun. Uh, excuse me, viewers. Emergency decelerator. Cool. So... Should I be afraid? Because I am. Hmm, we got more tools. I'm wasting an asshole of time in here. But that's because I've never been here before, so everything's a mystery to me. Alright, so we have... Hogs. You know, we should hold ourselves a war with these gears. Nah, I'm not any going any farther with that. I'll look a note. Oh, it breaks down again. All right, so just the levers, and the right amount of pressure inside the chamber. Up eight and down eight. Make sure the flow is set according. Trinity steam set functions. Four phase altitude or amp. Altitude. Complete steam flow cycle. Note the machine will not check proper configuration until all rods are inserted. That's what she said. <laughs> okay, that was just horrible. Anyway, this is the first rod. And with that eerie music, I'm expecting something to come and rape me. So I have an ink bottle. A bottle of ink. But that door just startled me. Alright, nothing's gonna rape me, because it doesn't seem like anything can get to me. Oh, look, tinder boxes. And a weird painting. Huh. I'll take these ashes. Or, what I seems to be an urn of ashes. Oh, hey, look, it's one of those blue things. It'll be my turn. Have I not shown restraint? 
My patience spans centuries. From where I came, mankind has not even wasted a breath. Yet I bow to you. I have done so much for you, and I have gained nothing in return. Agrippa, I trusted you. It was I who, in all fairness, should have entered that gate. Alright, then. Now that I realize it, these things do remind me of those black urn lantern thingma fuckers you find in Penumbra. Hmm. Maybe they have some kind of. Like. There we go. Oh! Those were trees that were dying in the background. Are you like a wake or something? I don't know, it's a very. Very shovel. It's a very weird sound. Alright, so I got the rod. And hopefully that's everything I need in here. Cause I didn't seem to see anything else in here. Oh well. Okay. Now they're back out here. I know there's nothing back there in the guest room. And we can't go anywhere over there to the wait. So did it say the machine room needed a Wait a second. I just remembered something. We got a crowbar. There was a door back here in the guest room that was broken. Or the lock was broken. Hmm. Why didn't I think of this earlier? At least I think it was here in the guest room. Because everything jumped when I entered the room. And like before, I'm gonna go prepare my pussy corner, or closet. Alright, so... It's locked, or due to a broken lock. So let's try this crowbar. Yeah! The key. Please, let it be here. Alright, so... Now I have two closets here, so... Oh, fuck. I was right! Closet means danger! Should I look... Probably the stupidest idea I've ever had, but I want to know what the hell that thing is. That's a creepy motherfucker, that's what that is. Is it is is it gone? Is it gone for good? Alright, well, all I know is the thing was, like, wearing some really tight straps on its ass. Alright. Nothing, nothing. More nothing. And what do we have in this drawer? Nothing. Anyway, no. 4th of July, 1839. It's done! The orb is assembled! I was awakened by an exhausting nightmare. Shaking and sweating, I retired to the drawing room with a cup of tea. The relic pieces lay spread across the table as I'd left them, but somehow I knew how it was supposed to be. I fetched the tar, which I had prepared to fix the pieces together, and without fault I joined them, producing the orb I remembered so clearly. The tar proved unnecessary. It was pushed out from the joining pieces as they merged on their own, with no adhesive. The ancient stone relic now rests on my table. Its immaculate surface and perfect shape could have been molded by a factory. This is all too strange. Indeed it is, Daniel. But then again, you remember, you're in a video game. And there's a stuffed 
grab it on my fireplace. I was about to say, well, at least this one isn't really fucked up on the side, but yeah, I was wrong. Poor rabbits. 